Welcome to the 2017 Pioneers in Engineering Robotics Competition. This year's game is Dry Another Day, a coin-operated game. Dry Another Day is composed of two alliances on a 12 foot by 12 foot game field. Alliances will compete to score clothes and slide in coins. The field has a clothesline that is hung above the center of the field. This clothesline divides the blue and gold alliances. There are two types of clothing on the field. One type of clothing is the socks. They can be found on the ground on the field on reflective tape coming from the starting zone. The other type of clothing is the shirts. They can be found suspended to the clothesline. Coins can be found near the corners of the field. There are two types of coins. One that doubles the team's teleoperated score and another that halves it. These multipliers will be applied at the end of the match. The coins are scored by putting them into the coin slots or the small chutes. Both coins are virtually indistinguishable, but can be identified with an RFID tag on their surface. The last game items are the hampers. There is one blue hamper and one gold hamper on the field. Points are scored with the hampers by placing shirts or socks in the appropriate alliance color and by having the hamper end up on the appropriate alliance side. The game begins with all the robots in the starting zones located on their half of the field. It will start with the 30 second autonomous period where robots will run pre-programmed code. Points will be deducted for not leaving the starting area during the autonomous period. During the autonomous period, teams can perform tasks such as scoring clothes, coins, or grabbing hampers. Coins scored during the autonomous period work in a special way. Coins placed in the lower coin slot will receive 20 points times the multiplier of the coin. Coins placed in the higher slots will receive 30 points times the multiplier of the coin. The autonomous period is followed by a two-minute teleoperated period where robots will be controlled by the team's drivers. During this phase, alliances attempt to score points by putting the laundry into laundry chutes, putting it into the hampers, or by scoring coins. However, there are penalties for contacting clothes and coins that have already been scored. Robots may also not remove, leave, or destroy the game field or its pieces. This may result in penalties. At the end of the match, the referees will tally up the total points and the alliance with the most points wins. Good luck teams, and remember, you can always dry another day.